Okay, how about now? Sorry. Testing. Testing. Is this thing on? Okay. Hello, hello! Yeah, sorry about that. Was just making sure the, the mic was coming through. Uh, my stream deck isn't completely set up yet. Oh, and I see we have Pseudosci Studio themselves in the chat. Hello, hello. No problem. Happy to do it. I'm looking forward to, to playing this here. And hello, Matt from the Awesome Duo. Welcome, welcome. All right, so I already put my birthday in, so I should be able to just go ahead and get started here. Oh, okay. I was not expecting that. Three. <laughs> uh, okay. After you spilled wine on me. I had some dry spots right here. Not today. This feels like the 80s. I've just seen something else, and let me tell you. The United States of America, home of beautiful nature. We freaking love it. These flowers, those kinky rabbits, these goddamn people. Love them all. <laughs> yep, yep, definitely got an 80s but feel to it. Ooh, those are some interesting noises going on. <laughs> hey, OFG. This is an indie game called Pseudo Psy Play. It is a survival horror. Okay, so controls. The... Can I do... Does it have to be arrows or is it... Okay. Yeah, it's got to be arrows. Up to switch weapons. Down to roll. Hold on. Oh, you can't roll with the gun. I gotcha. That's what that means. And space to shoot. Make yourself at home. Okay. Kind of reminds me of the uh, creatures from Resident Evil. Oh, backspace to leave. I guess that's... Can't roll only with... Gotcha. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Some music. I do have streamer mode on, so I'm assuming this is okay. Uh, TV. Can't do anything with the TV. There's a picture over here. Kind of a standing curtain. Sorry if that's loud. Uh, let's see. That's for the controls. Okay. Looks like that's the only thing we can interact with. So let's go to the door. More cards in the full game. Okay. Welcome to your pseudo side play. Here are three main stats. HP, pistol bullets, and shotgun shells. You can't restore any of these resources while in combat, so choose wisely. Good luck. It, okay. Good to know. Uh, okay. So these are... the cards. Alright. Oh! Okay. That is how I live. I don't know what to think anymore. Everything that's happening... Okay, good. It's not copyright. It feels surreal <laughs> that's good. A little bit to me. I've never awesome! Before. Thank you, Matt. There was from no the movie. awesome duo. This time it's great YouTube name web. different. I can sense the evil that awaits me behind this wooden door. I should be ready to face it. Hang on, Rose. I'm coming for you. I see he's talking to me. That's my middle name. All right. 
Oh, I keep going to the WASD. It's just, it's it's habitual at this point. Oh, okay. Hold on. Whoa, 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 whoa. I made a mistake. I pressed the wrong button. <laughs> Hold on. Here we go. All right, guys. Whoa. Okay. Hold on. Hold on a second. Do I only get one bullet? <laughs> Ooh. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, hold on. I'll get the hang of it. Bear with me. <laughs> hold on. There, there is a way to reload, right? Did I miss that in the instructions? Whoa, 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 whoa. I feel like I'm missing something. Hold on a second. Okay. So let me walk back from that. Um. Yeah. I don't... I guess bullets is... Uh, one of the, um... Stats it mentioned. So maybe I gotta use this. Okay. Ah! Get, get back! Get back! Get back, you creepy rose-headed thing! Okay. How do I, um... How do I... Joseph? Oh, there we go. Wake up, you sleepyhead. <laughs> Try, bear with me, guys. I, I haven't played it before. I should, probably should have done a little quick run before the uh, stream, but I like to dive in not knowing anything. You being dumb. Joseph sleeping on the sofa in front of the TV, okay? Uh, a terrible incident has shaken up Blackrock. Rose is cautiously approaching sleeping Joseph and then trying to wake him up. Joseph, wake up! Wake up, you sleepyhead. What? What happened? Our bed, Joseph. It's so cold. I thought maybe you could warm it up for me. Oops. Oh, I guess that was a dream, huh? Okay, so maybe Rose is no longer around. <laughs> okay, well, I'm not good at hard games, so I'm probably going to make a fool of myself, but, you know, that's okay. I'm used to doing that. Um, okay, I was just curious if that was going to change or not. Whoa! Hold, whoa, hold on! Whoa! Whoa! You weren't kidding. I... Hold, hold on, hold on. That's too fast. Okay, let me... <laughs> too fast. Okay, now I gotta switch to this weapon and hope those weird pinwheel things are gone. Alright, now I gotta... Beat up Rose again. Ah! Get back! Get back! No! 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 Not happening! Get back! Ooh! You really didn't want to go down, huh? Had a bad dream, didn't you? Characters Rose Underwood, Joseph Urban. Joseph, honey, you had a bad dream, didn't you? No. Why? On the wall. Why are you lying to me? And to yourself, too. I know something's wrong. There should be no secrets between us. After all, I'm your wife. I'm your wife. I'm your wife, Joseph. She's really leaning into that. Okay, okay. Yes, I had a dream. Not a pleasant one. You were inside the house. You were calling my name, but I couldn't find you. So I followed your voice, and there you were, in the kitchen. We sat across from each other. Joseph, honey, are you alright? You're so pale. But that rose from a dream was not the same rose I knew. I felt it. That woman, she looked like you, but she wasn't. I don't know how to explain it better, I'm sorry. And so, what was I doing in that weird dream of yours? Oh yeah, that other rose, she was chewing something. Brain. 
By the way, I'm really hungry, Joseph, and I wouldn't mind to eat someone. Okay, <laughs> all right. Yeah, that's not something you hear every day, huh? I want to eat you, Joseph. Okay. I. That's probably meant as, like, flirtation, but it's coming off real creepy. <laughs> Super unsettling. Oh, hey, Greg. What's up, buddy? Rose lies on top of Joseph and kisses his cheek. Do you love me? I love you. Yeah, that was creepy. <laughs> She's just very hungry. Yep. I, I, I got that impression. All right. All right. Um, ooh. Oh, it, I guess it wants me to look at the cards first and, run. and then run. But I don't remember there being a run button. Ah! 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 Was there a run button? Did I miss the ro run button? I must have. There's got to be a way to run. Shift, control. I'm sorry? The rolling? I forgot what the rolly button was. Can, can someone remind me what the roll button was? I apologize. Down? Oh, thank you. Um, can you get out of the way? Can you get- can you get out of the way? <laughs> You're too slow! Can I just- maybe I can get past? Oh! Oh! What just happened? Oh. Player 2 has entered the- excuse me? What? You're not allowed in here. Who invited you to my game? A twist. <laughs> uh, pseudo sci play starring you and Rose Underwood. Interactive drama fiction video game where your broken memories are falling down. Catch, eat, digest, then repeat. Let's start. Uh, wait, what? What am I doing? Oh, oh, okay. Ah, 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 ah. Things Pretty got awesome. weird. This is the best. Rose, what are you doing? Piece of cake. I don't trust Ooh, you. This, is the best. Freaking awesome. this this Rose person is very suspicious. Hey. Must be like fruit ninja. So many apples! Oh, I have to get like a certain number. Oh, there's a timer down there. I just saw it. Okay. Good. Tasty. I'm the one pressing the buttons. Oh yeah. I wonder if your score here matters. Freaking awesome. Get a bonus if you like hit a certain score or something. <laughs> Prologue. Which came as a surprise. Falling down. Everyone has their own house. But before the house appears, it must be built from bricks of the unconscious mind. Wow, that was a loud yawn. 
That's a lot of apples. Doctors would be terrified. Yeah, they said an apple, an apple a day, not a bushel. Where am I? Very good question. Where are we? Church Dale Valley with some coordinates. Okay. Joseph, you're here. Air Dunfield. Okay. Maybe we're in a dream again. We're stuck in some kind of time Joseph, loop. Honey. Oh, it seems like we're on the other side of the dream now. Deja vu ravine. <laughs> okay. Hey, didn't All we start these here? Rooms seem pretty familiar to me. But I guess I've never seen them before. Where am I? Ah. Uh don't know. Sought, sought him plateau. Oh, okay. I get it. Sought. Joseph? Joseph, I need you. I think you need to do a little construction on your house there. Your insulation showing. Lineswell Hill. Oh, at least this room's in better shape. I feel so weird. Barely remember anything. I just remember Joseph. I must find him. I must. Okay, if you say so. Beg for mountain. Joseph, please, please, please. This room's in rougher shape than, than the other ones. Blue forest. Kind of like going through the, uh, the rooms of your mind. Well, well, well. Whoa. Hello. Okay, Rose. Can get out of the way. Red Hat Waterfall. Going all over the place. Nope, we're back in this room. Oh no, wait, so this room doesn't look as good before. Behind like an old broken doll. <laughs> Twisted my arm, snapped my neck, and finally broke my heart and threw it away. <laughs> Joseph. Uh oh. <laughs> okay. I suggest you seek therapy. Don't sound too hot. I can't make out anything they're saying. I don't think I'm supposed to be able to. Am I supposed to do any? Oh! I could interact with it. Hey! Oh, and a piano! Can't hear anything. Oop! And a very creepy hallway. I don't like this hallway. Just went from very creepy hall. A rich person's house? Very big statues. Right? 
want me to cut open the box? And there's a phone inside and a tape. I feel someone's presence on the other end of the line. Can I ring someone up? Oops. I might have clicked a little too fast. As a kid, I especially loved Saturdays because it was my it was time for my favorite TV show. That animated series was called something funny. Uh, Animaniacs? Sorry, I can't remember the title. I just remember that it was originally run on Channel 58. But the fact is I love this animated show so much that I decided to record the recent episode on the tape. Just knew it wouldn't disappoint me. So I took one of my parents' tapes and started to record on it. You know what? Enjoyed that new episode. So when I finished watching and recording, I had an overwhelming desire to immediately rewatch it. That's how much I loved that show. Each episode lasted approximately 20 to 25 minutes. When I finished my second watching, a man and a woman appeared on the screen. Had some kind of dialogue, I guess. And then they looked right at me. Saw through me. Just like all these people that are watching you. That's creepy. Then the woman started telling me this old as the world fairy tale. I bet you've heard it before. Once there was a boy. He had a dream. He wanted to fly. Fly like birds. So one day the boy climbed onto the roof of his parents' house and jumped off it. He hoped he will fly like a bird. But instead, right after his jump, he's gone very, very wrong. From now on, this wrongness followed the boy everywhere, like some kind of reflection. Wait a minute. There's also a story about the girl who couldn't leave her room. No, she wasn't locked in or something. She just couldn't leave it. The room followed her. It was just one single room. For the girl, it was a whole universe. Damn. So, who is that story about, you ask? Boy, maybe about a girl? Well, I don't know yet. The only thing I know for sure is that now I'm completely fucked. <laughs> I've sworn on streams before, so. But there's new people here. I'm not entirely sure that life has a dick. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> I'm not entirely sure that life has a dick. But what I know without a doubt is that it always finds a way to fuck you up. You know what? That's that's a fair statement. Always. Ooh, fading out. We're going dark. Let's start to rewrite all the data. Oh dear. Okay, memory wipe incoming. Oh man. It's like the old IBMs, huh? Does that say rewriting happiness? It does. Rewriting parents. Now I just need a uh, matrix printer. <laughs> yeah. Blast from the past. Chapter one. Joseph's pseudo side play. Ha 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 ha. Joseph. Ah! That was loud. I couldn't know for sure she died. But one night, 
suddenly realized that she was alive anymore. I don't know how I even figured it out, but at the same second I felt relief. Maybe I'm an awful person, a monster in a human body, but there is nothing I can do about it. That's great. Considering you're washing your hands after thinking that, I'm a little suspicious. Rose? Is this really happening? My sound cut out? Sound back now? Hopefully. Okay. Sorry about that. I don't know why my sound just randomly cut out. Oh, hey, Kaylee. Thanks for stopping by. And yeah, I think he did it too. <laughs> I really do. I was highly suspicious. Oh. Oh, what what is going on with all these noises? Ah! Why did I do that? I have regrets. Oh. Okay. Okay. Rose Underwood, once Mother Nature told her that she is special. Jessica Marie Fisher. Back playing as Kashia Sorrow. Or Sorrow by Kashia, I guess. Okay. Relief. Well, that's a dead woman. And. Rose! Muslin. Okay, I probably couldn't have announced that anyway. Um, do I need to walk? No, I'm, I'm pointing and clicking right now. Okay. Rose! Oh, okay, gotcha. These are, Rose! These are uh, credits. Gotcha. Oh, where should I click? Oh, okay, I got it. Where would you go? Where would I go? Down the street at the moment. I like the uh, artwork in the background there. It's pretty. Ah! Well, Why can't I just get what I want? Whoa, a little, little dramatic there. Guys disturbed. Uh, press space to apologize. Okay. Apologize for killing her. Hmm. Sus. Sus. Please, please. Scare you? Probably, she's just freaking dead. Oh, I see something in the distance. I am sure I'm saying that wrong. It looks like he probably did do it. Yeah, it, it's it's very suspicious. Whoops. Sorry. It said I highly doubt I can walk through walls. This apartment building. 
Does it really stand right on the road? It's a little unusual. Beautiful. Yeah. Okay. You pronounced my surname right? Really? Oh. I thought I was like way off. <laughs> oh, there's a phone. Um, one, two, three, five, six, seven, eight. Ah, shoot. Okay. Uh, I know. <laughs> that is a really familiar sound. Uh, star eight nine. Yeah. Uh, six. <laughs> Alright, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me try that. Eh. Nope, that didn't work. Oh, maybe 911? 911. This is. This might be a different country, though. I don't know what the 911 numbers are in different countries. Uh. 211 for information? 999? Is, is that? Is that like 911 in a different country? I'll try it. No? Uh, okay, how about 211, like for information? No? Backspace to leave. Oh, I don't actually know if I'm supposed to successfully get a call through. Press zero repeatedly to talk to a human. In one country, you just frantically press all the numbers. <laughs> hey, Night Night. Thanks for joining. Uh, <laughs> you'll be given phone number after the first one. Oh, okay. All right. Then I will back out and not continue to waste people's time. Oh, why am I hitting space? Back space. There we go. Oh. Suicidal man plummets 12 stories. Wow. Wait, let's that in the picture. Are those body parts? Eh, I can't really tell. Okay, let's go in. Oh, we're back home. The creepy apartment is our home. Oh. Black Rock, Clay I'm Street. In the house. Please, I need you, Joseph. Are you sure? Pretty sure I killed you, so I don't know if that's a good idea. Eight six seven five three zero nine. <laughs> Have you tried the numeric for guest? <laughs> no plant here. Not getting any really much sunlight. You gotta put it closer to the window. Really pretty music, by the way. Oh, so good going to Kashia. Just like some cool old video game, you know. All right. Oh, do I not have any weapons? I saw a shift. Shift and up? Oh, okay, that makes me run. Gotcha. Press space and it. I can't get best that. The man. Listen. I don't actually know what that's supposed to say on the door. If it's supposed to. Whoa. Oh, sorry. Sticky keys. Sorry, right, guys. I hit shift too many times and it did not like it. I should have turned sticky keys off. Now I am. Um... Eh. 
Base doesn't seem to be doing anything. I wasn't supposed to go that way. I was supposed to go this way. Nope, can't go that way. Then I link. No, I can't go in there. this bureau. Oh, okay. I think I just picked something up. Okay, I might have to go... It said golden key. So I might have to go back to that other door because it looked like it had a golden handle on it or something? Hopefully I'm correct on that. Wasting time. Hey, it worked. Elevator. Where do we want to go? Uh, I guess floor two? Nope. That way. Oh, wait. Hold on. Sorry. I don't think that worked. Did not take me to floor two. Fine, take me to floor three then. There we go. Next area, the room of her desire. Her shaky desire. Okay. Whoa. The rubber hand. Can't pick up the dress. A bathtub? Is there a bathtub in the hallway? I can't get in it. Um. Interesting. Okay, I guess I need to go back in the elevator. Will you take me to two now? Okay, yes. The room of a man who wants to leave. Go that way? Okay, let's go this way. Wait, I'm back on the... You were supposed to take me to the second floor! You liar! Nope. Take me for the first floor. Wait, couldn't I go this way? Confused. Well, let me in here now. Yeah, all right. Whoa! 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 That wasn't there before. WC. Uh. <laughs> Why do we got? <laughs> Why is this music going? <laughs> this is the music from that um old horror film. Oh, seriously? That's come on now. Yeah, take a bow. <laughs> Freaking everyone out. Alright. Oh, this... Whoa. This one? This... Yes, Psycho. Thank you. I don't know why I just blanked on the name there. Whoa, whoa! <laughs> what the heck just happened there? <laughs> Yeah, that's my reaction. <laughs> that was pretty good. 
I appreciated the reference and it was pretty funny. <laughs> That doesn't seem like a normal reaction to playing a horror game. If the story of our lives was fiction, it would probably be served as the strong basis for some shitty ass horror game too. <laughs> right now, I feel so bad about myself. Like in this very moment, I suddenly realized that none of this, none of this is your fault. Most important, you were the only one who really took care of me. Not Rose, not somebody else. Okay, so this is the daughter of Joseph and Rose. <laughs> well, I, I think. I don't want to sound like a drama queen. Not at all. I just need you to know that I'm really grateful for everything. Okay, so daughter's name is Lily. You are truly the best. Okay. I guess that's good. Kind of weird that you thought about your dad when playing a uh, horror game, though. But is it a good enough excuse? What I've done. No, man! You killed Rose! It's not a good enough excuse. Ending like a fiddle. <laughs> you. Total time, 40 minutes, apples eaten, 238. Ah, oh, see, I knew the score was going to come in at some point. Firewalls jumped? There were firewalls? As in, like, computer firewalls? Or, like, actual walls of fire? There are seven endings? Oh, okay. Um. Ah! Yeah, he definitely done it. Oh, that's a little bit dark, but I believe it says, If you enjoyed part one, please consider adding Suicide Play to your wish list on Steam. Tried to make the demo as replayable as, as possible. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, okay, so I'll try to get another ending then. And not, like, suck as much. <laughs> oh, there's a new card. The Abundance. That's pretty. I like the artwork. The artwork and the music in this game is very nice. I don't know what to think anymore. Everything that's happening feels surreal a little bit to me. Are those pills? I've never had a gun before. It sounded like There's pills. No need in it. But this time it's. This is a cheat card with infinite ammo. Oh, I like that. I sense the evil. <laughs> I, the I like infinite ammo. I should be ready to face it. Okay. Hang on, Rose. Artwork is really I'm cool. Yeah. The artwork is cool and the music has like this somberness to it. Oh, right. Whoa! Okay. That cheat code is not currently working. So maybe that's something I don't get access to right away. Go away, Rose! Alright, I killed you once! Don't make me do it again! Or do I have to pick it up? Joseph, oh, was it supposed wake to? Up. Wake up, you sleepyhead. Okay. Alright, so since we already saw this, I'm just gonna 
skip through it. Mm -mm. Maybe a bug. Okay. That is to be expected. One good. I forgot about these things. Oh, shit. Shit. I don't like those thingies. Alright, Rose. I'm coming to beat you up with a stick. Nope! 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 Back, evil woman! You had a bad dream, didn't you? Okay. So we'll skip through this. And access chapter selection to the TV. Oh, okay. Gotcha. So I should go to uh, chapter one then. Because uh, I'm assuming that's where I gotta get to to actually like access the different endings. Thank you. Making fun of Joseph. Don't make fun of Joseph. He already killed somebody. Kill you too? Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. Oh, that's a good sign. If Brandon's not looking at his magic cards, You've done something right. For sure. <laughs> That's a good sign. <laughs> oh, sorry. I should probably should have skipped that. Hold on, guys. Oh, I'm sorry. I have to hold it. Oh, did I do that wrong? Oh! Oh, no. The game closed. Oh. Hold on, guys. I apologize. We're experiencing a technical difficulty. Oh, it's exit the game? <laughs> oh, no. Ah! I'm so sorry. <sighs> Can't see the magic behind the screen. That's my <laughs> in menu it says escape. <laughs> I'm sorry, I thought it said escape to skip. Oh <laughs> uh, that's okay. It it wait, it's still saved, right? Oh, why is it hold on. I don't know. There we go. Uh what? Oh no. Does that mean I gotta start over? We'll still have okay it still has the chapter it's okay it's all right guys we're good <laughs> thank goodness <laughs> sorry about that i could have sworn it said escape to skip what did it say to skip then do i need glasses maybe i need glasses Oh, uh, uh, see? See? Right there. Press escape to skip. Oh, is it just press to skip and then hold to exit? Like, if I just go... Ah. I'm a doom. Yep. Okay. <laughs> Oops! Sorry about that, guys. Got to see behind the curtain. Great and powerful Oz. The 
with the might of OBS. Rose? Is this really happening? Hey, there's a little figurine here. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> I didn't take it that way. Oh, it, it did the little, um... Simple as that. One up like sound. Cool video game, That's know? cute. Okay, so I'm wondering how I get a different. I'm assuming it has to do kind of like. Paper. Mm -hmm. Okay, I was just curious if it passed there. Just checking. Ooh, that was a nasty noise. Okay. The resolution of my screen? Yeah, uh, my screen is a weird resolution. It's a uh, 3440 by... 3440 by what? Taylor, I remember what it was. Four, no, 1440, I think, right? 3440 by 1440. It's a, it's an ultra wide, so it's not surprising to me that it looks a little bit stretched. Although, I am streaming in 1080p, so even if it looks stretched for me, it shouldn't really look that stretched for you guys. So that's a little bit strange. Um. But I guess that could still be the effect of uh, the ultra wide. Okay, twenty by twenty one by nine. Great, thank you. So what happens if I just press one? Huh? I'm already on one, but it still triggered this, so that's interesting. That's it. You got a little bit of a, a leakage there. Oh, there's a light. Oh, there's a computer. Don't trust the tap water. Nitrates found in tap water have been linked to cancer, copper, and endocrine disruption, as well as Alzheimer's disease, plastic fiber. Huh. Oops, wrong button. And the oop. Sorry, I was just I was trying to check the drawer. There's a generator here. A super loud generator, damn. Oh. Oops. <laughs> well they say curiosity killed the cat, so. Shocking ending. Yeah. Right? Oh. Well, wait a minute. How do I... Hmm. Can I turn this off, maybe? There's... Yeah. Maybe I have to go to a different floor and come back do something with the generator to then do something with the power supply thing there. Maybe it... Yeah? Electricity killed Joseph. Can you roll under it? Under the generator? 
Well, it's not, um, it's not letting me roll right now, though. No, it's, it's not letting me roll at all at the moment. Uh, let's try going to two now. Did that say live and then change to leave? Or are my eyes playing tricks on me? Okay. Let me just check this. Oh! This was level one, but I pressed two and I ended up here. Well, let's see if anything's changed. Uh... Anything new? No? Okay. Look the same as how we left them. I haven't done enough. Did I try going this way? Wait, that might trigger an ending. Uh, let me go back to the elevator. I go to three. I don't want to, like, trigger the ending prematurely and get the same end. Shoot, I pressed one or two. Because two took me to one. Let's try one. All right, here we go. Um, now I don't know how to use an item. So this. Oh, okay, cool. It worked. the sears. Rot in hell. That's a 13. Thank Oh, oh, gone. Oh, okay, so it must be a certain order. Okay, so not that order. Six, nine. Nine eight seven. What that says? 
Puzzle time. Yeah, I'm bad at puzzles, but... It keeps changing the numbers on me. Now it's a seven, eight, six, nine. Now it says eight, six, nine, seven. Puzzle keep changing every time. Searching. I think like what number would represent one, what item? I thought maybe this would represent six. Excuse me, because there's one, two, three, four, five, six items. But then by that logic, this doesn't match any of the numbers. Is it supposed to be like... The numbers are representative of letters. Maybe the butterfly. Uh, what's the eight? Hmm. <laughs> well, like I said, I'm not good at puzzles, so don't expect me to put it together quickly. Also, the numbers keep the the, the numbers. Yes, the numbers keep changing their location, so that makes me feel like the solution keeps changing, but if the solution kept changing, then I wouldn't be able to be brute forced. So maybe the numbers are there to distract you. Okay, I was trying to think of it from a storytelling perspective, like what would come first. Hmm. Okay. Can you interact with anything besides the window? Um, oops. Sorry. That would be negative. It's just the window. So you have to figure out the puzzle. I'm just gonna get it to reset. I figured from a 
storytelling perspective, it would be the butterfly, the house, the rose, then the sad face, or the house butterfly rose sad face. You need to do some operation with numbers on the window to get the correct order that is on the wall. Well, the wall said what I believe to be 13.5, I think. So... Sorry, I'm extremely bad with math, so bear with me. I'm not going to get a point 0.5, though. These are all whole numbers. Unless I have to do, like, some division? If, if I need to do division, then I'm going to have to break out a calculator, because, like, that's what I struggle with the most. <laughs> So just tell me if there's division and, and I will break out a calculator. Um, hmm. I just, so. I, I guess what I'm struggling to see is how the numbers connect to the pictures. Like, even if I was to figure out why 5 was significant to those numbers, why would it matter with the picture? You're acting. Right, right. That I get. But I don't see why the numbers would tell me. Okay, hold on a second. So, for instance, if I was to do 9 minus 5, then that would be 4. And that would be the fourth picture. And then 7 minus 5 would be 2. Okay, let me try that. If that's... If we're going left to right. Uh, 8 minus 5 is 3. 6 minus 5 is 1. Oh, okay. Yeah, it took me a moment to kind of piece together, like, why does that matter? And, and then I got it. Well, it took more than a moment, to be fair. It took, it took a couple moments. Dead bodies! Oh. Um. Huh? Ah! I couldn't move. I was stuck. I did get it. It took me a while, but I got it. Puzzles are not my strong suit. I overanalyze things. Did I end up getting the same ending? But tonight when I played this I definitely did things differently. For some reason Yeah, that was the same ending. The electricity. Did I miss something? Like should I have not run to the right right away? Or did I do the right thing and it's just that you always get the same message at the end? Uh, the same voicemail at the end, I mean. Hopefully I actually did the right thing there. 
and did technically get a different ending. I said count how many other ones did you ride that elevator in terms of the order to make sure you got something else. He unlocked for him. Okay, so so that voicemail that came up at the end then that's what you always get at the end of the demo. Excuse me. Oops. Okay, just wanted to make sure that, like, I didn't screw something up there. Goodness. Sorry, guys. Not sure why I'm sleepy so early. <laughs> what the? Rose? No, Is this really click happening? on it. Let me click on it. Oh, did I forget to grab that last time? I did. Okay. Simple as that. Just like some cool old video game, you know. Alright. Let's see if we can figure out another way to do this. Okay. There are also things in the bathroom. if I get to the bathroom. Oh, wait. Okay. Oh, I got it. Um, four. Time to hit the old dusty road. <laughs> All right, night, night. Thanks for joining, and I'll talk to you soon. All right. Oh. Now this is the area with the, um, I mean, I'll grab it. But. But. Sorry, I got... Brandon is off to the side over here, so if you see me, like, suddenly looking to the side and you're like, what the heck is she looking at? It's because Brandon's over there and sometimes he's trying to get my attention to... to bring my attention to something in the game, so... Just so you know, it keeps happening. Um, okay, let me go to one. She knows. <laughs> Allergy setting in. Alrighty. Right, this is the This is the one where the oil spill. Yikes. Alright guys. Okay, so I don't wanna actually turn this off this time because then it'll trigger something. Although I guess I don't have to go in that door even if I trigger it. 
Yeah, I'll, I'll just be on the safe side and go back in here. Okay. Now, I picked up an extra key when I was in the... Oh. I don't remember what was on the other side of the place. Oh, it's the WC room. This was, is this the, um... The bathroom? I'm afraid to go in. Accidentally trigger it. Okay, so it's not- whatever key I picked up, it's not to that door, because it's not when- Okay. What if the door- the moon emblem? Opens up at night? Uh... Moon emblem? I'm not sure if you mean this one. Because I can't really tell what that's supposed to be on the door, to be honest. I'm also not sure how I'm supposed to trigger it being- this one? That- that is supposed to be a moon? Hmm. Alright, I'm gonna be honest, I'm not seeing that. <clears throat> Bathroom? Pixel art is hard. No, I know. That's fair. It's totally fair. I don't know if I'm right, but that- Bathroom is probably just- out the chapters and check the stuff in the hallway where you started. Uh, I'm in the hallway where I started. Because if we go... You so... Shush your mouth. Yeah, okay, this, this is the door that I have to enter. I did hit space on that door. Okay. I've been hitting space. You don't see my hands, but I've been hitting space. All the things. That looks like a moon up there to me, but that that's a light bulb. Clock clock is another. Yeah, I, I see that the clock is stopped. Um, but I can't interact with it. So there must be a way to get it going again, I would assume, to make the door open. Um, I'm gonna try going in this room. Okay, this is the room with the with the silly violinist. Playing psycho music. What? Better to type it out than to try to talk to me when I got my headset on. Yes, very very well done. Thank you for your performance. Oh. What the heck was that? Trying to click on her, but nothing happens. Hello. 
Uh oh, I think I triggered the ending by accident. Now, I guess once you go into that room, you do trigger the ending. Okay. So that's my bad. I thought maybe I could do something else in there. So hold on. Alright, we can get back in here. I'd like to trigger uh, one more ending if I can. Amen. Excuse me. Now I'm trying to think where else could I have gone for the clock. Rose? Is this really happening? I still don't know what that, uh... Hi. I still don't know what, uh... Simple as that. A key like is for. Just like video game, you know? Go back in there. Okay. I'm to make sure I check everything. You guys got long strides. Got them gazelle legs. E. Thought I can go get in the elevator. Some endings are hard to get. Yeah, especially when you walk into a room you can't get out of. <laughs> yeah, I couldn't remember for sure if, uh, if I was able to get out of that room or not, so. That's just me being forgetful. Okay. The game considers your real time. In your language? Okay. If it considers my real time, it's already nighttime. Oops. I pressed the wrong button. Alright. <laughs> Pay respects. <laughs> Unless it has to be midnight to match the clock. Oh, if it's gotta be midnight to match the clock, then uh, I'm not gonna be able to do that ending, because I, I can't stay up till midnight. I have work in the morning. Okay. Just checking.
sure. No. Dress. Bathtub. Checking if there's anything else. I'm also listening to the, the music in the background. I was just wondering if that had anything to do with something. I'm probably just going in circles. <laughs> Okay, so I know if I go that way, it'll bring me to the room uh, you can't get rid of. Get out of, excuse me. Ding dang key is for it that I picked up in the washroom. And can I interact with something other than the door at the end of the hall? I'm not gonna go go in, I'm just seeing if there's anything here I can interact with. No, okay. Yes, checking. Flag on the wall. There's only I was gonna ask about that, like is is that specifically because I'm from the US? That's cool. Uh, a little touch. Oops. Oop, what did I just click on? I meant to click on one. something in the there. Um, whoops. I don't actually know how to get back to the TV room, though. Maybe I still need to... Do something there. Do something there, but not actually go in. Oh, no, that turns off the elevator, though, when you do that, because it turns off everything. And turn it back on. No. Okay. I thought maybe you could, um... Trigger something to happen there, but it looks like the, uh... Excuse me, the only thing it triggers is the, uh... The power to go up, and therefore that door to open. Oh, okay. Oh, it won't let me- Ah! I wanna go over there! 
won't let me. One very distinctive door. Yeah, once you know how to do it, it's easy. Yeah, I can't go um, anywhere to the left, so. Nah, it's it's gonna. Huh? It's making me stop. Okay. All right, so I I did not get a new ending there. It's all about experimenting, right? So. For the ending that has to do with opening up that door with the moon symbol on it, Joseph? do you have to match your real time to the time on the stopped clock? I'm just curious if that's how it works. Maybe. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, I'm just I'm just asking because like again, there's no way for me to actually get it during this stream if that's the case. Alrighty. We will skip over that. I see, it does look at apples eaten. But can you change your time? But you can change your time at any moment. Oh, you mean the time on my computer? Um. actually haven't changed my time on my computer in a long time, so I recall how to do it. I just need time. I really suggest to turn on Yeah, I have streamer mode. And Hold on. Well, okay, let's see if that does the trick. Oops, didn't mean to do that. I don't know what to think anymore. Did not mean to do that. I meant to just go to chapter one. Can I go back to... Get out of the way! Get out of the way, butterfly! Joseph, wake up. Wake up, you sleepyhead. Okay, there we go. Sorry about that. If the abundance card works, my face cam froze. Uh oh. Oh, everything froze. Can you guys still hear me? Or did that freeze too? Oh no, it's just it's just the face cam. Ooh, okay. Uh one second. Oh, it froze on this end too. Let me try turning it off and back on again. I can... On. What's going on? I don't know what that was about. Sorry about that, guys. 
It seems to have like switch sources on me or something. I don't know, maybe it didn't like it when I was messing with the date and time. Rose? Is this really happening? Right. Interesting, the key didn't show up this time. Simple as that. Just like some cool old video game, you know? So, I reset my time, uh, but the door still won't open. Or maybe I still need to trigger something? Either that or it's not registering my time, or maybe it has to be exactly midnight. I don't actually know how to, like freeze the clock on my computer, though, if that's the case. You need the exact time to open the door? Okay. Hold on. I don't know if it's going to, uh... work. But maybe if I stand right near the door and try it again and my uh, webcam might, might do something wonky again, so bear with me. Oh, oh, okay. That seems to have done it. There we go. I always wanted to fall in love, but not with her. Don't get me wrong, I love Rose, but in another very special kind of love. Like the kind of love where you kill someone? I need to tell you something. But this has to remain between you and me. Stop recording right now. It, I'm streaming, man. Can't be helped. What do you mean you can't? I'm streaming. Stop recording right now. No! I'm not going to stop the stream for you. You stop recording. Wait a minute. Are you telling me that your viewers are good at keeping secrets? Sure, why not? You trust them? As well as one can trust people they don't know all that much. Okay, fine. You win this one. Thank you. Continue. Oh, we're in a field. There's Gladiator. It's the ending of Gladiator. Oh. It's no longer the ending of Gladiator. There's a big apart. I am not. You're not trustworthy. Okay. I can't seem to do anything with the building, so I'll continue. Oh. Oh, it's coming back. 
You're following me. Oh, wait, you're different. Is this the front of the building? Because there's none of those, um... Uh, escape stairways. Or escape stairways. I'm waiting for it to show up again. Oh, oh, here it comes. This one's got ladders. Maybe the first one did too. I thought it had stairways. It might have been ladders. Birdie. Oh, I can run. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Rose, you seem to have become a balloon. Oh, I'm falling. I fell. I fell into a cave. A creepy dark cave. With skeletons stuck in it. Uh. Fuck. Watch. Excuse me. Well, I'm right handed, so I'll go to the right. Oh, where'd my mouse go? There it is. I want to keep going to the right. Am I going in circles? Might force me to go to the left. Okay, maybe I need to go to the left. <laughs> That's very nice of you, but you shouldn't. Oh no. I have no sense of direction. I've made a terrible mistake. <laughs> okay, just make sure I'm not missing anything I can interact with. So maybe it's left. Left. If I was actually in this cave system, I would be absolutely doomed. You want to escape a maze cold and to the left wall? You mean your hand? Alright, I mean, I guess I could keep going left. But it seems like no matter where I go, I end up in the same spot.
right again. They go to where's the light? I don't. Frankly, I don't. I don't see light. I'm gonna be honest. I'm assuming, like, as you go, these are supposed to get lighter, but I'm, I'm not... I'm not noticing a difference so far. I would say that this looks lighter than the other one did. Um... Maybe it's just too dark in this room because yeah, these these don't look light to me. Or maybe the screen settings are too dark. It's dark because it's night. Oh, okay. Hold on. Let me uh Oh, I guess I need to Let's just change it to Sorry if I freeze again. Twelve PM. Oh, okay. Don't go to the light at the end of the tunnel. They don't reach for it. Oh, got there. Oh, okay. Say I can't interact further. Am I dead? That felt like dying. <laughs> oh, that's what the watch was for. Okay, gotcha. Yeah, I'm just not used to, like, the time of my computer actually being a component in a game, so I didn't even think of it. Cool thing to do, though, to, you know, have it set up in such a way that it can read your time and, uh... The country you're from kind of messes with it more that way I thought about you. clock wasn't on the top left this you know if the story of our lives was fiction it would probably be already did that for some shitty ass horror game too Alright, so what ending is this? This is The Harvest. Interesting title choice there. To me it seemed like, you know, going into the light, so... Death of... Essentially. Going through a dark tunnel towards the light. Alright, so we are just about at 9 o'clock. Um, typically I do my streams for two hours at a time, just so that I don't, uh, wear out myself or the audience. So we got three out of the seven endings possible, uh, which is pretty, pretty impressive for a demo, have seven different endings you can get. Uh, so as the message here says, uh, pseudo -sci play is on Steam. Be sure to check it out. You can download the demo for yourself if you want to, absolutely free. Um, and if you like what you have seen tonight, or if you go play the demo and 
enjoy it for yourself, then please add it to your wish list. Um, and a big thank you to Pseudosci Studio for coming by to help me <laughs> with the game because uh, I definitely needed some help figuring out some of these things and I'm not good with puzzles, so appreciate the help. Thank you for coming by and, and helping to uh, promote this very unique experience. Um, this was this was a uh, quite the trip. I really like uh, the psychological thriller aspects to it. I I loved the part where the the rose monster was playing the, the psycho music. That was super funny. Uh, I'm really excited to see where this game goes. I think this has got a lot of potential. You're doing a lot of cool things with it. So congratulations on making a very interesting game here and i will certainly add it to my wish list sorry for the rear resolution oh, i mean look it's not done yet uh when i play these indie games that are still like in early access or they just have a demo or something i do not expect everything to go smoothly <laughs> so no problem at all uh, totally expected. And honestly, this played a lot smoother than some of the other uh, demos I've played. So, all right. So we're going to end it here, folks. Thank you again. Thank you to everyone who stopped by to show your support. Please make sure to take out, uh, check out Pseudo Play yourself. Thank you again to Pseudo Play Studio. And I hope everyone has a wonderful and not so creepy night. Hey, Carol. Thank you.